What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Uber Sports TV. Back at y'all with another one. So as, so as I said yesterday, there's a lot of um, uh, past and present boxers, uh, legends, that's sent, giving Mikey Garcia more and more of a chance to be victorious against Errol Spence Jr. Um, the latest one is Bernard Hopkins. He's stating that uh, he's slightly favoring Errol Spence to win this fight by a split decision, by a hair, he said, due to the fact that uh, he has the size advantage. He says, but uh, if Mikey Garcia was to win, it will not be an upset. It will just be a victory. He says, Mikey Garcia beating Errol Spence will not be an upset. It won't be a, um, you know, a surprise, he says, because he has all the, the intangibles. He has all the skills. He says, it, it's going to be a very, very close fight that Errol Spence is going to pull out. And it's going to garner a rematch because um, people are going to feel like, you know, um, Mikey Garcia has a chance to win the fight. So he's thinking that, um, um, so he's seeing that Mikey Garcia has so much of a chance that it's going to garner a rematch. He says, um, this is going to show, he said, this is going to be a very, very tough fight for Errol Spence. Uh, he says, and it's going to show if um, he has what it takes to, to be lifted into stardom. Right. He says that. Um, but this is definitely a very, very close fight. Anybody who thinks that Errol Spence is going to walk through Mikey Garcia doesn't know boxing. He says uh, and they're sadly mistaken. He said that's not the case at all. Uh, <clears throat> he says this is a match where both guys have so many weapons that they can use. I think Spence has a slight edge, but he won't necessarily be the winner. I think this will be one of Spence's toughest fights and it will show whether or not he reaches stardom, and the same goes vice versa. Garcia has experience. He has been the he has been to the dance many times before, and that's important. Garcia has all the tools to beat, not upset Errol Spence, but beat Errol Spence. In terms of styles, he has what it takes to win this fight without upsets even being mentioned. It's very close, and I think they'll do it again. But I believe Spence wins this one by split decision. Wow. You know, so he feels like, you know, this is going to be a very, very close fight. He says that uh, Mikey Garcia has all the tools to win this fight, not upset Errol Spence. With, he said win this fight with upset not even being mentioned. And he says that um, they will do it again. And uh, he said he, he favors uh, Errol Spence to win this one by slight decision. But they will do it again in the rematch. And uh, this will prove whether these fighters have what it takes to be um, casted in stardom lights. I, I totally disagree with Bernard Hopkins, but who am I to disagree with Bernard Hopkins? The great Bernard Hopkins, he's moved up in weights. He's um, went from middleweight to light heavyweight, so on and so forth, and he's been uh, successful in doing so. So who am I, you know? But uh, I know what my eyes tell me. My eyes tell me that the stylistically, uh, Errol Spence is um, too big, too strong, with too much pressure and too much power, and I don't think Mikey Garcia has what it takes to keep Errol Spence off him. But then again, this is fight week, so we're going to find out. But that's all I got for y'all. It's your boy, Blue, Blue Blood Sports TV. Hey, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell icon to get all the new notification. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV, all one word. Y'all already know what it is. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Shout out to New Media. Shout out to Black Media Raw. Make sure you like and share these videos. But now, Hopkins says, Errol Spence. Uh, can lose to Mikey Garcia and it will not be an upset. It just be a victory with upset not even mentioned. He said it, but he favors Errol Spence to win the fight by a slight um, split decision victory. That's all I got for you. Peace.